Hi, this is Mrs. Mace. I'm going to show you how to create a postcard using your Google Drive and Google Docs. First thing you're going to do is go into your Google Drive and go to Create and Document. Now to do this, one of your first challenges is to get to your paper with a different orientation. So you're going to go to File and Page Setup and you're going to make it Landscape Orientation. Then click OK. Now the next thing you need to do to separate, you can do it by doing columns or I found an easy way to do it would be, be to make it into two boxes. So to do that, we are going to go to insert and table. And we just want to make it two. So we we'll click on that and obviously that is very small and it's not big enough but we can make it bigger by just dragging this down and you can keep going until you know it at the bottom page. If you go too far, it's going to go to a second page, so just be careful. Okay. I'm just going to bring a little bit out to the edge. And it usually doesn't let me go mu much on the top. Now the first thing you're going to do is to, you're going to type your information for the postcard on this side. Then your information will go in this area right here. Now to put an address on your postcard, you're going to go over here. And at this point I'm going to center it for my address and bring it down. Then you could put name, street, address, city, and zip. Okay. Now, uh, also something fun, if you wanted to try to insert a stamp, you could do that just by doing an image. So I'm going to actually put this over to the right side and I'm going to click insert image. Now I already uploaded and saved a picture onto my computer so I'm going to choose an image and I have a stamp right there and you can see it will go right into place. Now at this point you have a postcard format. Your information will go here. Now if you wanted to make this two-sided you could go on to a second page and have it print out set two-sided. If not um, you can create your other page and, and glue them or staple back to back. Thanks. Just let me know if you have any questions.